Thank you for coming to talk to me today. Sebastian, I want to know from you, how do you do it? Do you like numbers? Yes. Why do you like numbers? Mathematics. You like mathematics. <coughs> so how old were you when you could first do sums like that? Can you remember? Hmm? Grade two. Grade two. So Bali, you, you, you probably remember better than he can because he probably yes. had those numbers just ri racing around in his head. Yes. At what age did you notice that he had, I mean, it can only be it was described as a old. gift. Yes. Yeah. He was eight years old. Eight years old. Yeah, and what was two. it? How, no. how did you find out? Mm, his class teacher. Yeah. Uh, he called me in. Then he told me that it was, a, 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 am I aware? Mm -hmm. His gift, and I told him that yes, I am aware, but like not that much. What were the first signs for you? No, uh, once morning he asked me one question like, Mom, do you know meds? I said, yes, I do know meds. Then he asked me some, and I couldn't answer him huh. back because it was a huge number. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so. And he deals with very big numbers. Yes, he really, he really is, does. Yeah. You know how useless I am at maths, Sibashle? I was terrible. Can I tell you, I was failing maths when I was in high school. It was so bad. So I wish I was like you. So I think we, we're going to... Can I try some this morning? Can I ask you anything? Yes. Any, any sums, anything? Whether it's addition, multiplication, anything. Okay, well, I'm going to need a calculator because I'm completely hopeless, okay? So I'm going to do that. Let me get to my calculator first of all. And let's see. Okay, so let's ask you, what is 2,650 times 15? 2,650. Times 15. Are you calculating? Yes. Okay, we'll let him calculate that one. Okay. And then, do you know how, how this works out in his head? Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, it is true. Are you gonna get a are you gonna get a close up of that? Let's show it let's show it there. Yeah. Thirty nine thousand seven hundred and fifty. That is <laughs> incredible. Absolutely incredible. Okay. Sorry mom, I have to try another one and then we'll okay, <laughs> have fine. a chat, okay? Um let's try this one. Let's try eight hundred and ninety five times 11. 895. 5 times 11. Yes, okay. 9,845. Absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, we're all feeling so stupid here on floor, aren't we, guys? They're like in awe. Absolutely in awe. Now, I know that you, you can answer even in, in very, very, very big numbers. So I'm going to try this one, okay? Let's okay. try 900 and 25,000 times 12. Can you do that for me? Yes, 11 million and 100,000. Absolutely, absolutely, that's what it is. Absolutely, absolutely. What, while I'm gonna show you. No, no, I, I know you definitely got it right. I'm not asking you to confirm that one. I just want to know from you, when I ask you that question, Sibashle, when I give you that sum, what are you seeing in your head? What are you seeing? Like, are you just seeing numbers falling into, do, do they go into the right place? What are you no. seeing in here? Um, when I ask you the sum, or the answer just comes to you? Yes. Just like that? Now you know he's never going to go back to school after this because we're going to have like NASA or somebody phoning us this morning yes, to say, I book him a ticket. Yeah, hey? that would be great. <laughs> so, I mean, is there anybody in your family in Bali who has had a gift, who, who's good at maths? You've already said it's not it's you, okay? It's my brother. It's my your brother, brother? My eldest brother. Is it, and, and yes, he's quite good. Similar to this or not even close, but good at maths? Yeah, he is good, but not similar to him, yeah. Yeah? He's great with maths. So science, yeah. you can go straight to matric. Do you want to go straight to high school, Sibashle? <laughs> eh? Yes. You want to go straight to high school? Yes. You don't want to stay in primary school and do all of these other silly sums that the other kids have to do? Yes. <laughs> what happens with him in class? I'd like to know. I mean, it would be terribly unfair to put him in a normal maths test, I would um, imagine. In class, he's doing good with his mathematics because I think he enjoys numbers. Yeah. Yeah. So is he only going to do maths all day? What about his other subjects? Does he not really like those? He's average with other subjects, yeah. Well, who needs other subjects when you're yeah. this amazing at maths? Who <laughs> exactly. needs to do any other subject? What do you want to be when you grow up, Sebastian? Did you already think about it? Pilot. That? 
You want to be a pilot? Yes. So I definitely this match is going to help you. Yeah. Now, you know we had MEC Panyazala Sufi in this morning, the Gauteng Education MEC. I think they've, they've got a, is it a, a flying school, a flying program, a pilot oh, program? Awesome. We're going to see. Maybe he's, we must put you in touch and see if you can already get you into that program. That's going to be amazing. Mm. So what else, what do you do for fun other than maths? What do you like to play with? Do you like to play games, normal games? Do you games. Like to, yeah. Do you like to do other things? You just like to do sums? Yes. Does he just like to do sums? Does he drive you mad to just give him sums at home? Mm, not exactly. Yeah? yeah or does he, he do prepares, otherwise? Does he do anything uh, for fun? Mm, yeah, he plays all by himself. Uh, playing with the leads uh, from those bottles, Coca-Cola yeah, bottles. Yeah. So, yeah, he just keeps on counting with those leads. Just yeah. counting leads? Yes. Anything to do with counting and numbers, yes, that's what he, he just does? just enjoys that. Oh my goodness. Yeah. And I mean, your neighbors, your family, your friends, I mean, are they asking him, is it, is it every dinner, every get-together, come, let's do some sums? I can just imagine this poor yes, child. Yes, sometimes it happens. <laughs> eh? Showcase yes, at every yeah. family gathering. Yes. So, Sibashle, what do you say to other children who are like me? I was, te I was so scared of maths. I didn't, numbers used to make me very frightened. What would you say to other children who don't really like maths? What would you tell them about why they should like their maths? <laughs> Okay, okay. so maths is wonderful. Maths is great for you. And I hope that, uh, I'm, sure, I'm sure that we're going to see you flying in the skies at some point. Can I do one more before you go? Okay. We just have to do one more. I'm trying to think of one more to do before we actually let you go. Are you going to school after this? Are you going to no. go to class after this? No. Or you, you got the day off? You're giving him the day off? No, he must go back to school. He must, he must go back to school. I think no. he doesn't need to go back to school. What does he need to go back to school for? Okay, let's try this one, okay? Should we try this one? Let's try 5,625. Can I do addition? Can I do an, ad can I, can I do an, an addition sum? Plus 4,986. Don't know. Okay, it's too many numbers to remember. Must I do multiplication rather? You like the times ones. Okay, let's do that. Let's do 4,960 times 40. 4,960 times 40. But I still think you should give him the day off. Why, while you calculate that, you're going to work that out. I'm gonna, I think that you should give him the day off. I think he deserves an ice cream. Yeah, or two. he is. Yeah? Yeah. yeah? <laughs> Most definitely. Most definitely he yeah. deserves a nice cream. 198,400. Absolutely. Give him the whole tub of ice cream is what I say with sprinkles. I have to shake this hand because you are going to be a genius. You are a genius. You're going to be an even bigger genius. Thank, thank you for you. sharing with us and thank you for coming in. And I think mommy should let you stay at home and have ice cream. Don't you think so? Yes. Yes, I think so. I think we all think so. Wonderful. Yay. <laughs> Yay.